to the state of addiction now. The annual prescription drug take back day wrapped up this afternoon and organizers say the event in partnership with KCRA 3 and law enforcement agencies was a huge success. And as KCRA 3's Leticia Ordaz reports in Sacramento, big crowd showed up to get rid of unwanted medications. It's a different kind of spring cleaning. Hundreds went through their medicine cabinets on this Saturday and made their way to the Sacramento Police Department. These pills are like pills that my family has had that don't need them anymore, even some for my pets and, you know, just a variety. I've been kind of saving them because I'm not sure what to do with them. During prescription drug take back day, the Sacramento Police Department teamed up with the Drug Enforcement Agency to make sure unwanted or expired pills don't get into the wrong hands. We really want to make sure that we keep these prescription drugs out of the hands of teenagers and, and kids um, because they're extremely dangerous. The effects can be, you know, life altering. Some grandparents dropping off their old meds don't want to take any chances. Absolutely. I've got three grandkids and they're, they were up high, high, high on a counter, but you never know, you know know what's gonna who's gonna climb counters and get into things it wasn't in a locked cabinet so yeah it could be a disaster Patty Waters admits to holding on to expired pills for some time now. I have a big bag of stuff back from 2008 that I've been wanting to get rid of and I didn't know what to do with it. At the Sacramento Police Department, 20 bins provided by the DEA filled up rather quickly and officials say the four-hour event had to end early. Those who got rid of their family's meds in time were quite relieved. And it feels good today to get rid yes, of them? Yes, yes. It's a big <laughs> load off my shoulders today. Probably 20, 30 bottles that we put in, up on the bags to get rid of them. It's surprising to see like people with bags of, of prescription medication coming in, but it also shows how important this event is. If you missed today's event, not to worry. The Sacramento Police Department says it now has a permanent drop box for medication, so you can come use it Monday through Friday. Bring your unwanted pills in Sacramento, TC Ordaz, KCRA 3 News. And there are other permanent drop-off prescription sites throughout the region. You can find them under the State of Addiction tab on our KCRA 3 app. Before dropping off those medications, make sure to take the pills out of the bottle, put them in a plastic bag, shred all the information that's on the label, then recycle the bottle.